A delay on the tracks leading to a delay in the lives of many folks in Dauphin County, one particular community. So they're unable to get to work, school or run errands because a train is blocking the only street out of their homes. About that, CBS 21's Hallie Jacobs is there in that spot of Halifax tonight with this problem that's been going on for a while. They're trying to solve it too. Hallie. That's right, Joel D and Jasmine. Now, these Halifax residents living on Ingle, uh, Ingle Nook Road have been dealing with this issue for around 20 years or more, and they've had enough. Now, in a recent Facebook post, one of the neighbors who was blocked by the train for nine hours on Monday voiced her concerns as well as other neighbors. <laughs> God forbid if something would happen, um, there's no way to get in to help them. That almost happened a few years back. One medical emergency impacted by a train. There's a lady lives up here. She's not 96 or 98 years old. And there was a medical emergency and the train did pull out as soon as they heard that. They opened a crossing. For the past two years, the second and only other way in and out of Ingle Nook Road has been closed. Because it's it's hardly ever been used, and semis are always getting hung up on it. Leaving people trapped for hours on end when a train stops on the intersection. Not being able to go to work, kids not being able to go to school. Um, your day pretty much stops for the, for the day, um, not knowing on how soon you're going to be able to get out and do anything. No one knows what causes it. I don't know the situation if the, was, the train was stopped here for a red signal or if it stopped here to change crew. Or how to stop it. We called everybody and they just ignore us. We're just nobody. But they do know it brings nothing but trouble. I woke up about 4.30 in the morning, I get ready for work, and I'm thinking, you know, that trains are just gonna leave by the time I have to leave for work, and uh, sure enough, it didn't leave, and it's, it was here till about noon. They know it's possible for the train to move, but every time they call the helpline on the blue sign, Nothing happens. I call that number every time there's a train that stopped here. Uh, they take your name. They say that somebody's going to get back in touch with you, but unfortunately, they, they do not. We did reach out to Norfolk Southern in a statement to CBS 21. They said, quote, this area is a spot where trains stop to allow for crew changes when they reach the end of their service time. Sometimes the replacement crew can be delayed. We flagged this particular crossing to avoid stopping on it whenever possible, end quote. Officials say they'll also bring this issue up at the next township meeting and also try to work with Norfolk Southern to get a solution resolved here. Now, in the meantime, uh, if this does happen again, they are suggesting that they also call the county, who will then alert the emergency management uh, coordinator, who will then try to mediate the situation. I'll send it back over to you guys.